Hello everyone, I'm Simon Sechukobilagu. Welcome to yet another wonderful video about TBC. Today I'll be giving you guys an update um, and a message, okay? Message, especially for those who are old members of TBC who, how would I say, there are different categories of old members in TBC. There are old members who have paid the admin fee, They've they have updated the crypto, uh, Kringo Cash account, they have the new wallet, okay, and they are, okay, they have paid the admin fee, the new admin fee, okay. Now, there is another set of old members who have the wallet, they have Kringo Cash, but they still, they have not paid the new admin fee, okay, and their old fee in terms of the 10 in terms of the ten dollar fee they paid earlier, that was the fee that was paid yearly, is still running for them. So probably the admin fee is going to expire maybe in September, October, November, or December. Okay. Now there is another set of old members who have Kringle Cash. They have zero zero four, but they have not paid the admin fee. Okay. Or oh, they even they, they even have they have find a way to open 009, okay, but they don't have not paid the admin fee. So these these two fall under the category of those who have not paid the admin fee. So I'm just going to stick it to this three, okay? Then there is the fourth, okay, fourth admin admin old members, okay, those who have not migrated at all. They are just stuck in TBC 004. And some of them are coming back to TBC. So you see some of them, you know, I get a lot of call for some of them who pay their, who want to like, okay, you know, they don't have access to 004 anymore. So what they need is they need access to maybe create this. So they create a Kringle Cash account and create 009, uh, 009 wallet. They pay the admin fee and they have their coins migrated to them. So four categories of old members. Let me say them again. Those who have paid the admin fee, the new admin fee, and um, they are up to date. Those who have, those who have, you know, paid the old admin fee, but it's yet to expire, but they have 009, they have Kringle Cash, okay? Then there are those who have Kringle Cash account, okay? They, some of them have 004, some of them have 009, but they have not paid any Kringle Cash admin fee at all, not even once. Then there are those who are yet to migrate. Okay, so this is my message to them in terms of, in relation to this admin credit or, or August promo that is going on. See, if you're an old member, okay, one thing you need to know is this, okay, the admin credit is never going to apply to you in terms of going to use it to pay your own admin fee. Okay, except if you're an old member, that is yet to register on Kringle Cash. And yes, I know the TBC admin said if you have not paid your admin fee at all, but I believe is if you have not registered on Kringle Cash. Because the process flow of this admin credit is when you register on Kringle Cash, okay, automatically your admin fee is covered. Okay, now I don't see anywhere an, an old member who has a Kringle Cash account, okay, will benefit from admin credit in terms of using it as admin credit to register. So the only old member who will benefit from admin credit in terms of registration is the old member who is yet to migrate, who is yet to migrate at all to from 004. That is the one who does not have Kringle Cash account and does not have 009 wallet. So that's the only old member that is likely to use admin credit for registration. Okay? All right. So have a clear out of the way. Let me now focus on the remaining three, which is those who have Kringle Cash account, but probably they are up to date uh, or... 
they are still on the old fee or they have not paid any fee at all but they have Tringo cash account okay so here's my message to you in terms of admin credit okay if you're an old member here is what you need to do okay if you're an old member here's what you need to do okay the only way you're going to benefit from admin credit is if you pay your admin fee with bitcoin litecoin ethereum or through through a bulk payment credit and you receive admin credit to register two new people okay that's the only way you're going to benefit from admin credit okay you cannot use it to pay your own admin fee per se but you can use it to refer two people okay even the uh, the uh, uh, the old member who is here to have a Kringle Cash account, the moment his admin fee is paid with the admin credit, automatically he's going to have two admin credit to refer two new people and, that pay, and the admin fee gets paid automatically too. Okay? So, I hope this message is clear. But the, for, the, but for the sake of clarity, let me retrace my step again. Okay? If you're an old member, okay, and you ha don't have, you have not migrated at all to Kringle Cash, you don't have 009 wallet, okay, your benefit, you're going to benefit from admin credit in terms of using it to pay your own admin fee, okay? For example, if you contact me and you want to migrate, but you don't have Kringle Cash account, you don't have 009 wallet, all you simply need to do is probably use my referral link or the referral link of anybody out there, okay, to register. The moment you register, as long as that person has admin credit, as long as that person has paid their own admin fee and have admin credit, the admin credit is going, and he has not used the admin credit for any other person, an admin credit is going to be used for you automatically. Okay, so you stand a chance of a, a, a very big chance of getting using admin credit to pay your own admin fee. Okay, now the benefit of those who have Kringle Cash account and probably you have not paid any fee at all, or maybe you're still on the old fee, or maybe you have upgraded and you're on the new fee, but you have not paid for August, is that the moment you pay your admin fee, the current admin fee of $23, but approximately make it $25 to cover for the, you know, Bitcoin cryptocurrency network fees, okay? So, when you pay that fee, okay, automatically you are going to be giving two admin credits for you to refer to people. So, that's your benefit. That's also the benefit of the old member who does not have Kringle Cash account at all. Because the moment his admin fee is paid for him with admin credit, he is going to get two admin credit automatically. Okay? So I hope this message is clear. So if you're an old member out there, don't feel like you're left out of the admin credit uh, of the August promo. You are heavily a part of the admin of the August promo. All you have to do is know where you fall within these four categories of old members okay and how to take advantage of the admin credit based on where you are based on your category okay so guys that's it for this video i just want to make it a short one and an educative one so if you like this content please give me a thumbs up share this video and most importantly subscribe to my youtube channel so you get updated updated every time a new video is, is uh, comes out okay so to ask you guys next time take care bye for now